everybody. Welcome to the Apple Watch Killer Features video. The Apple Watch is one of the most personal devices ever made by Apple. There are so many different business cases as to why it's so great for some, but not overly useful for others. In this video, I'm going to go over some of the major features of the Apple Watch that I find useful and show you how it adds convenience to my life. The Apple Watch is not a mission critical device like an iPhone, but it is a really handy accessory. One of the biggest things that brings value to the Apple Watch for me is the convenient notifications it offers. Whether I'm at work or out for dinner, not having to constantly pull your phone out of your pocket to see who's texting, emailing, or even calling you is really handy. It's a convenient way to determine if something needs your immediate attention or can wait until a convenient time to be dealt with. For my use, I have only one of my four email addresses show notifications on my watch, as well as text messages, phone calls, and weather notifications. That way it's mostly important stuff showing up on my Apple Watch. Notifications like Twitter or Facebook on the Apple Watch I find are overkill and have you looking every minute or two which takes away from what makes it useful. When setting up your Apple Watch, I would recommend only sending notifications from sources that are time sensitive to you. But as this is a very personal device, that could be different things for different people. The second feature I find makes the Apple Watch so handy is Apple Pay. This feature of course depends on whether you are in a country that supports it to start with, and you also have to have a debit card or credit card with a bank that supports it as well. And lastly, the stores around you have to accept it. I'm in Canada, and here most of the major banks support Apple Pay, so my debit card works great through Apple Pay. Also we have lots of stores that accept contactless payment. I would say 80% of the places I shop at on a regular basis accept Apple Pay. It's so fast and convenient. Just double tap the side button and you're done. Another killer feature that makes the Apple Watch so handy to have is the music app and complication. Whether you use AirPods or any Bluetooth headphones, you can remotely control the music playing from your iPhone using the Apple Watch. Since I use AirPods, I use the watch in place of the inline remote so I can adjust the volume, fast forward, rewind, play, or pause. But this feature will work with any set of Bluetooth headphones and is super handy if your headphones don't have an inline remote like the AirPods. If you'd like to learn more about how the Apple Watch helps you control music remotely, you can check out my AirPods tips and tricks video. I'll leave a link in the description below and at the end of this video. The next killer feature I find useful of the Apple Watch is the Activity Tracker and Workout app. This helps me track how many calories I burn a day and whether I'm meeting my daily fitness goals. Plus it has a pedometer. And the Workout app is tailored to help me see how many calories I'm burning when doing a specific exercise. This way I can review my workouts and see what's working and make changes accordingly. It's a great fitness tracker. Another killer feature I find I'm using more and more is the Apple Wallet on the watch. Specifically being able to access my Starbucks card. It's so handy to order your Frappuccino and just pay using your Apple Watch. But other useful benefits of Wallet on Apple Watch I found were loading via train tickets on it and my SIM card. So convenient to be able to use loyalty cards or access trip tickets without having to pull anything out of your bag or pockets. I fully recommend taking advantage of this feature. I don't think it would be that big a deal when I first tried it, but over time it's just become second nature and now I find even pulling my iPhone out to use Apple Wallet more work. The next killer feature I get a lot of use out of is unlocking my MacBook Pro with the Apple Watch. When your MacBook is in sleep mode, you can automatically log in and unlock your Mac when you're wearing your Apple Watch and it's unlocked. Since most of us don't restart that often, that makes logging into your MacBook a breeze. Just open it up and start working. A few other things I find really convenient about the Apple Watch is easily checking the weather, using Siri to set a timer, or checking my calendar using the date complication. Like I said, it's not a mission critical device like your iPhone, but it is a convenient accessory to have. So there you have it. Those are the Apple Watch killer features for me.
Did I miss any killer features? If so, share them in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to subscribe to the channel and give the video a thumbs up. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.